Well, good afternoon. Happy Monday to ya. Happy Monday to your baby. This is, um, if this is your first time tuning in, hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell to be notified when I go live and when I upload another video. Yes, leave me a comment and share. Today, I am doing a chicken and waffle review. Yes, I've been seeing this on a commercial. I said, uh-uh, I need to try this. And look, I'm so greedy. I had to get me some wedgies. But let me show y'all the waffles. I got chicken tenders and wedgies. Look, I had to get them. I had to, baby. Yes. Yes. Can you see? I should be showing you. Now, from what, I, from what it looks like, it's my first time trying it. It looks like it already has syrup in it. So from what it looks like, like they fried it with the syrup. Okay. Oh, let me. Oh, I can't wait. Oh, let me pour these out. Do me a quick thumbnail. Look. Okay. Oh, I can't wait to try this. Oh, now I'm drinking water. I got a cup of ice or a glass of ice in my water. Yeah. I, I told her I needed some ketchup. See, here I go. No ketchup. Oh, this looks so good. Okay. Mmm. Let me show you what it looks like with the syrup on it. So it won't drip everywhere. See the syrup is in the little crevices. Look, in the crevices. All right, let's give it a try. It's not bad. It's not bad. Clean talk. It's not bad. Mm. Mm hmm. Chicken tender. It ain't bad. It ain't bad at all. It ain't bad. But let me tell you this. It's thick. Okay, it's really thick. So you probably would need more syrup depending on how you like it, but it's really thick. It's really thick. Mm-hmm. I just put it in a little crevices. It's really thick. Now let me try it with the with the um like this, like a little sandwich. Look. Ooh. Let me try it like this. Piece of chicken. It's thick. You got to chew it. <laughs> it's really thick. 
You guys, it's worth buying. Go try it. It is good. It's really good with the chicken with it. If you bite it with the chicken, mm-hmm, it's good like that. And I want the wedgies. I mean the wedgies. Look, <laughs> the chicken tender. Here was my thought thought process. I, I didn't want a big piece of chicken because it was going to, to me, I, I wanted to, see, this is the main thing I wanted. And so I didn't want to get full off the chicken. And their chickens, you know, their chicken pieces are big. And I figured... The waffle is really small, so I figured that the wed that the um, tender would be just perfect on top of it, and it is. It's good, y'all. Mm-hmm. Baby, yeah. And it's, I'm going to give you a real, real review of what I think. It's hard on the outside, which is good. And it's, it's moist on the inside. Now, look at here. It does depend on where you go because they have different cooks. This doesn't seem like it's overcooked. You know, you go to different restaurants. You know how you go to a restaurant and you'd be like, well, last time I came, it was cooked really, you know, different. It was a different cook. Okay. So, but for the most part, I think they can't go wrong with this because I'm thinking that this is probably, they got this frozen. So it's pre-made. But it is really good. It's really good. Well, go ahead on, KFC. Okay. This is good. You should try it. And I dip some of my chicken in the syrup. It's good. Potato wedge. A little messy. Put the syrup. Oh, I love me some ice, y'all. Mm. Yeah, this is good, child. This is good, baby. Look, it come with two waffles. You know, I had to buy three. I had to buy an extra one. So an extra waffle by itself is like almost two dollars, like a dollar something. Mm. Yeah. This is good, y'all. And I like the little container. Look, I'm a, I'm telling you, 
Even the container is good. You can keep this. I like this because if I was to cook something, you know how people come to your house on Thanksgiving or whatever and you they want to take a plate home? You can give them this. I have lost so many, so many containers um, letting people take um, stuff home. Okay, so this is, shoot, I'm going to keep this. Yeah. Oh, look. Flavors of the South. Look, they because it's chicken and waffles, so they're going to say this from the South. Look, flavors from the South. They ain't playing. This is good. Me, where my oh here it is. Put it in in the little in the little squares. This is good, y'all. Oh, excuse me. It felt so good sleeping in this morning, y'all. Mm. This right here. This is going to put me back to sleep. It felt so good sleeping in. And it's feeling. If you don't have a big appetite or a big stomach, let me tell you, so when you order this, they have, it's called a one, a, a, a small basket and a big basket. Apparently I got the big basket, okay. So you can either get one waffle with uh, two pieces of chicken, either a thigh and a leg, a breast and a wing, and I think three tenders, okay? The big basket, you get two waffles, four tenders, and I think you get four pieces of chicken. If I can remember. Cause I wasn't paying attention to the chicken. I'm sorry. Yeah, you do. You no. Yeah. Four tenders and four pieces of chicken. But I got the four tenders. I didn't want all that chicken. And then I had to buy me an extra waffle. But if you don't have a real big appetite. If you eat like me, because I don't have a, I, you know, I, I, I don't, I don't eat much. You probably could do the, the, the small basket. Or just get one. Because these waffles, excuse me, these waffles, they're thick. They're really, really thick. Thick. They're thick. But they're good. And really, you don't even need much syrup. The may is sweet already. And I recommend you get the tenders. Because with the tenders, they fit right on top of the um, of the of the waffle, and you can make you a waffle sandwich. You can get so you would have to get you you probably have to get a buy extra one, but if you bought the small basket and just got the two tenders, you might have to buy an extra waffle, and you can actually literally 
put two, wop two. Um, see, look, you can literally put two on here, okay? And then, well, I've already been eating on this waffle, and then put this waffle right on top and make you a waffle sandwich. Literally. Mm hmm. You can. This is really filling. Well, go ahead on, KFC. This is really good. It's on point. It's hitting. It's good. Y'all need to try it. And they're accepting pre-orders for turkeys. You do a pre-order. They'll fry you up a turkey for Thanksgiving with a free with, with a pre-order. Go ahead on, KFC. So if you don't feel like cooking, do a pre-order with KFC. And you know what? If you got a Popeyes in your area, Popeyes is doing pre-orders too for turkeys for Thanksgiving. If I had a big family, I would do a review and buy one and do that. But it's kind of pricey. And I want to spend that kind of money when I, I won't eat all that. It'll, it'll, be, it'll go to waste. And I don't want to waste any food. Like I may not eat all this right now. But I will go back and eat it later. But I'm real passionate right now towards homelessness and poverty because we had it is just we had a big fire out here in Northern California. And this fire wiped out a whole town. Freed up a it 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 it, it destroyed a whole the whole town of paradise. The whole town. So um I'm real passionate towards that because not even with that happening, it's just a lot of uh stuff going on in the world today with poverty. There's a lot of people that that are not fortunate like we are that can have a meal. Or have a job, have a roof over their head, have their health, have things. And it, 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 to me, wasting food and throwing away food and, 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 and stuff, I just, I can't see myself do that. So, I mean, I will eat this later, but what I'm saying is I, I just don't want to, I, I, I'm passionate towards our vets. Because they go, out, they're, they're out there putting yourself on the on front line, fighting for a cause that they know nothing about. OK, and they come back and I see it every day in the capacity of where I'm a social worker. I see it every day. They come and they don't have uh, a lot of them end up homeless. They their minds are messed up. They're physically messed up. You know, it's just it's sad. So um, wasting food to me is just like I, I can't see myself do it. Um, so. I was thinking because one year me and my daughter um, on, for Thanksgiving holiday, we cooked up. I don't have that type of money that like I used to, but I made like two turkeys one year. I think she was in high school and we, I made a dinner. But what I did was I made two turkeys and then um, I, I we made sandwiches, turkey sandwiches. And we gave them out with chips and stuff like that. We did that one year to give back. And I wanted to show her um, what it's like to, you know, because she would always, you know, she was a single child. So it helped her be more appreciative of the things that she have, you know. And um, and then it gives you a self as uh, instant gratification. I know I do. When I help someone and I, I, I give back instant gratification, 
instant. Okay, it makes me feel so damn good. You know, when I help somebody, when I give, when I give back. Sometimes we have to give back, you know, and that's with anything. You plant good seeds. Here I go, y'all. Look, I, all, I, all I was saying was about turkey and it was too much. And now I'm getting story time. The plant you seed, that you grow, that you feed it by the things that you do, your actions, your thoughts, your intentions. Okay? So if you deliberately set out to hurt someone, you're planting a seed. You're planting a seed that one day karma, karma, and it, you, your life could be going on so smoothly and one day, bam, here it comes. You even forgot about the things you did and here it come. Karma. You know what? When I say get back, that's just like with YouTube. There's a lot of small channels. There's a lot of people that want to start a channel. They're brainstorming. They, they want to do it and they do it. And, and they may not, you know, stick with it because a lot of times people start something. They don't really know what they want. But they start it because it looks easy. It looks fun and da, da, da. But then there's some out there that really are striving to, to be successful. Okay. And Everybody has to start somewhere. Okay. And there's, there's some you, big YouTubers out there that will not even shout you out. They tell you in a minute, oh, I don't do shout outs. I'm like, wow. Not me personally, but things that I've, I've heard. And I have experienced a couple things. And it's like, wow. The art of give back. Of team playing or... It's a lot of people don't, they don't give back. They don't help. They, a lot of times too, and it's not just with YouTube, but life itself. Sometimes people forget where they come from. Everybody has to start from the bottom up. Everybody is a baby at first. You don't just be born and then you grown. Everybody starts off. You're a baby when you start. You need guidance. You need somebody to help you here and there. Give you some encouraging words. Tell you to keep going. You need somebody to help you stand up when you fall. But there's times when sometimes when people get successful, they forget that they were once a baby one time too. Okay. So in life, okay, in life, and it's hard. But try to plant good seeds because it'll help you in the long run. Okay. And the seed that you plant today is what's going to be growing tomorrow. In other words, and the choices that you make today, be careful of the choices that you make. Try to think it out first. Don't make any decision that's going to be a big decision. Hastily or out of emotions, you know, you get upset and you just that's when you calm down or when you get nervous, you try to make this decision. And you know, like just like when you go buy a car, all the salesmen come swarming in on you and you tell them, OK, I'm still looking, <laughs> you know, <laughs> this is my first lot. I have a couple more lots I want to go to, but then they start coming at you and they start making things sound good. We can give you this. We can give you that. We can give you this. We can give you that. Everything that sounds good ain't good. Okay. So think things through. Take a deep breath. Think things through. If you are emotional, if you're going through something, calm down until you get yourself together. And then make that decision. Then make that step forward. And pay it forward. If, if you see somebody that needs a little bit of assistance that, that you can give. I'm not saying money or this. It could be 
a prayer. It could be a word of advice. It could be a hug. It could be just an ear or a shoulder to cry on. Give it back because one day you're going to need it too. Everybody needs a hug. Everybody needs a shoulder to cry on. Everybody needs somebody to tell them you're okay. It's going to be okay. Everybody needs somebody to listen to them. We're human. We're all in this, in this walk of life together. Why not help the next person? It'll make, for me, it'll make me feel good inside. And you don't know what that's going to bring to you. You're going to prosper even more. You're going to prosper. And that's just like the shout outs on YouTube. That's just like the shout outs. I'm not, I'm, I'm going to use me as an example. If you shoot, sh give me a shout out, I, I'm not going to take your people from you. All you're doing is giving me a shout out. Telling people about me. It don't cost you a dime. You paying it forward. And out of your 150,000 subscribers, it may only be 10 people that may even do it. But that 10 that came over here, they're still with you. They ain't going to leave you. Plus, you might get 10 more for doing it. They might look at you and be like, wow, he really or she really. Wow. You know, I'm using that as an example. <coughs> Pay it forward, y'all. Pay it forward. You know, I get to talking. You know, I got to I got to give you a word every day, y'all. OK, even though I'm off this week, I, this don't stop, baby. We family. Y'all is my crazy. Look, crazy, crazy squad. Look. OK, pay it forward. Don't forget where you come from, because as fast as you got it, you can lose it. It's temporary. And all this earthly stuff, you can't take it with you when you go. When you die is what I mean by go. You don't see no U-Haul truck buried in the ground next to you. The house that you live in is still going to be standing. And if you own it and you pass away and you got a loved one, they may even sell it and somebody else is going to be living in it. OK, this is temporary. This stuff right here. It's temporary. What's forever is in here. Your soul, your heart, your feelings, your intentions, your thoughts. That's what you're going to take with you. That's what you're going to take with you. Treat people as how you want to be treated. You remember when you were starting off? Who helped you? Who encouraged you? Who told you to keep going when you wanted to stop? Who told you to keep your head up when you wanted to put it down? Who told you to wipe your tears when you wanted to cry? Pay it forward. It's not going to take nothing from you. It's going to make you feel good. And you planting good seeds. You're throwing good vibes out in the universe. That's all I'm saying. Look. Look, y'all. I can't finish this. I didn't got full. But um, this is what I got left. One and a half. I got two and a half of the of the chicken wedgies. I mean chicken. Look why I keep saying chicken wedgies. Chicken tenders and a couple wedgies. I'm full, y'all. But this KFC chicken and waffle, go. It go, baby. Try it. It go. It go. Now, look here. I hope you enjoyed this talk we had today. 
I love you guys so much. And I want to say, I want to give a thank you to every single one of my subscribers that come and watch my videos. I want to thank you for rocking with me. I, I want to thank you. I, you just don't know how much I appreciate it. Okay. I want you guys to have a good day. I'm sending out good vibes to you. I want you to keep good thoughts in your head. OK, fight off all that inside of you that when you just want to make you just cuss a MF out, fight it. Don't do it because you, you want to feel good inside. OK, don't let nobody steal your joy. Don't let nobody hook you in a toxic situation. OK, protect yourself from toxic people, toxic situations. OK. Look here, I'm going to sign out now. I want to tell you guys, hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell to be reminded when I upload another video. Like and share my videos. One more thing. Stay sucker free. Peace out.